Octopath Traveler is rated T for Teen by the ESRB. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Octopath Traveler. In the last episode, we came back here to Saints Bridge for Alfin's third chapter, in which he is now kind of... He has to contemplate the value of his work, in that he's... He has to now consider, is every soul worth saving? He saved a man who turned out to be a thief and a murderer, and the man he saved, who he had promised to turn a new leaf, has just betrayed Alfin's trust. So now we're here in the Riviera Woods, hunting down a man who broke their word. And I... I do remember this Time to chapter. Teach you a lesson. In the last episode, I mentioned that I wasn't sure if I had completed this chapter. And now that we're inside the Riviera Wood, I can say with certainty that I've played this chapter. What is the logical okay, Skull of Steel. Smite them down. Well, I don't have to worry about. I am ready. Uh, let's do... Item. The medium plum. Stay strong. <laughs> Here goes hmm. nothing. <laughs> Level slash! I'm just debating of whether or not I should switch Primrose and Alfin's ability. Not Alfin. Primrose and Cyrus's. Let's see. Scholar. And by that I mean like give Primrose the Scholar skill so I have two Scholars. I say this because Primrose My turn. has the highest SP count of the team. And then give Cyrus the... Uh, there's just... There's so many options to go. I am ready. Let's summon my town person. Panicus. You shot the wrong one. I am ready. Okay. Dancer. Let's do dark. Oh, he is weak to the darkness. Scholar skill. Uh, lightning. Merchant skill. Thief skill, actually, still. SP. I appreciate it. Really? Here goes nothing. Uh, warrior skill. Yeah. Apothecary skill. Amputation. Ha! Now, what uh, next? Scholar skill. Lightning blast. Nothing will quiet the storm. Out of my way. Thief skill. I am ready. Clarity skill. Holy light. The show is over. Okay. Uh, while I have this opportunity with Alfin, wrong abilities. Excellent. Rehabilitate. Now he can get the Dotler Charity, which we already know kind of what it did uh, because of Cyrus. For three turns, items used by a single chosen ally will affect all. So let's continue searching the woods. Silver filled pouch. This way. Ooh, creepy chameleons. 
Only weak to the axe, huh? <laughs> In that case, here you go. Donate to Alfin instead of Cyrus. An interesting dilemma. We'll start with Blizzard. Take the chameleon. I shall race. I am ready. Let's get my summon out. I have a Here feeling I have a very terrible summon. Uh, no, I want this. I'm... What? I'm actually really bitter about what just happened there. All three hits missed. Uh, donate BP, Cyrus. Here you go. I am ready. The peacock strut. The peacock strut. All right. I have no words for that. Nothing will quiet Holding the off because I want Cyrus to have the best strike attack. <laughs> Ooh, do I have someone with an axe based attack? Yeah. That's right. how you hit Alpha. I am ready. Okay, dancer skill. Watch me now. Perform skills performed by a single ally that usually target one foe will instead target all. I don't need that one. I need this one Elf, for Cyrus. Ringer of the flame. Here goes nothing. Okay, concoct. I need a medicinal component uh, for poisons. Try this. <sighs> Out of my way. Merchant. Hired help. Bandits. Someone's What's this? Now the true lesson to Now let's go lightning. Nothing will fight the storm. Oh, Thus now I'm sad. Your lesson. Also, Alfin was useless for the axe. I'm so upset by that. His whole duty was to use the axe. So I can't get the purple chest on this side. What's this way? Okay, I'm beginning to learn that the lizards in this forest are just awful. Let's go down, because I didn't see it loop back in the road that we were already on. Okay. Excuse me. Powerful yawning. This seems to just loop around the outside of the entire forest. May I oh, this dance? a wind elemental. This I will keep because this <laughs> is a new enemy-ish encounter. So, let's go merchant skill. Donate BP to the person who can make here you go. Cyrus double up. <laughs> I 
I am ready. Watch me now. The ability. Uh, ringer of the flame. To Cyrus. Here we go. Yeah. Off the carry skill. Healing grape pot. Try this. And scholar skill with the thunder blast. Nothing will quiet the storm. Nothing will quiet the storm. So that's kind of the best way to use the Alfred Bring it on. Cyrus combo. You give Cyrus the ability to attack twice. And it instantly improves his capability. Now, what next? And then we go Scholar Lightning Blast again. Not bad. A passing grade. And we're good. Now the chest. A new pomegranate. Let's continue up. Yes, so this path goes around the entire maze, and Miguel, I'm assuming, is up. Okay, so we could go up to Miguel, or we could f continue through the forest. I want the purple chest, so let's continue. Good find C. I know where right goes. And it's not good. I think I only have a few chests left here, and that's gonna loop around. I don't think there's gonna be a chest over there. I got the last one. Ice Amulet. So the Ice Amulet will reduce ice damage. Let's get to the save area. Let's go inventory and heal up. Everything is all good. Let's save. Go fight Miguel. Miguel! <laughs> Alfred. Fancy meeting you here. Brat wouldn't shut up, so I stuck him one to give him something to really cry about. You low-down pile of filth! Move aside and let me see the boy's wound. Not another bleeding step. As pleased as I'd be to see you fix up me golden goose. Something tells me you're just going to up and sneak away with him. The boy could die! And what of it if he does? I've got four miles to feed back at home. I thought it was three. Huh. Whoops. I should learn to keep my story straight. <laughs> you actually believed I had a bloody family? I don't even know where my next meal is coming from. You're so sodden and gullible, it almost moves me to tears. But I owe you one, Alfin. Thanks to you, I'm able to get back to honest work. <laughs> I give. This is my fault for fixing you. 
But that's why I'm gonna set things right. By my own hand! Step aside, Miguel! Sure that's smart, Alfin? I stretch the truth from time to time. But I wasn't lying about being a mercenary. Miguel Twin Spears has killed a hundred men if he's killed a dozen. Soldiers, mind you, not molly coddles toting a bag full of weeds. None of your potions or bandages will patch you up when I'm done with you! Better roll up the sleeves. Okay, so we have Miguel here. He is weak to the sword, which is a good start. Afraid you picked the fight with the wrong Out of my man. Way. Uh, yes, I think he did. I am ready. Double slash with that. I don't know if he's weak to the dagger, so let's bring in the summon. Because at least that gives us another hit. Now, what next? Next, let's start with our elemental oh, finds. Start with Rain. fire. Rock. Not weak to fire. Alfin would be best to use nothing. ice on first, so that yeah. I don't have to use that move with Cyrus next. Not weak to Mother. ice either. Let's try wind. Trade wind. Since he's alone. I don't have to use my big group hit. He's weak to wind, and because wind comes after all the base elements, I uh, I know that I don't have to worry about uh, Cyrus's abilities, which means I could technically go all out with those. Uh, let's see. Let's poison him for a Are little bit. Every move he makes, right. he'll take damage. Unless he has a heal. Ooh, Crossbeers did quite the damage. Here goes nothing. Uh, let's continue building up his poison. Get your poison. I am ready. Next, let's do. Let's start with light, because he's kind of a dark person. Good, he is weak to the light. Nice, that was a powerful. All right. It's okay though, because I do have first aid. That'll do her. Bring you back up to your full strength. Uh, let's do. Let's see how much health he has before we get too into it. Much to learn. 54,000. Okay. Uh, the reason why I wanted to do that then is because I don't really want to break him this round. It would be really a waste. So let's get BP donated to... Uh, speed. Oh, I can't even view that one. Okay, I think I have to break him. I am ready. Cleric. We're gonna make it so the strongest fighter can attack twice in one turn. Let's go. Okay, sorry, I wanted to see if I had a special super powerful move. Uh, let's go with lightning. Nothing will fly the storm. Ooh, that only did a thousand. I am ready. Okay, next. Let's do reflective fit. Oh. No, that's not gonna work. Because reflective veil does elemental damage, and he is not using elements. Oh, light. Okay, townsperson fled from battle. Out of my That's way. fine. Let's bring in three hired help. Help with the soldiers. Bring it on. Okay, next let's continue with poisoning because he's almost out of that poison. poison. 
And at least poison will be a constant damage to him in the 500 no matter what. This is his defenses, so now he's weak to different moves. At least the dagger is one of them. Uh... Okay, so how should I go about this? Let's go back to the elemental vine. Oh, Miguel. You just ruined your own life. Out of my way. Uh, first. Uh, I think it's gonna be the spear for his last one. Yeah. Here we go. Uh, I'm gonna do a massive heal with Primrose. So what I should do is concoct a good ability with the pomegranate. Try this. At least this way, my cleric. Heal more. Bring about a miracle of healing. Can heal a lot. Okay, next. Out of my way. Yes. Oh. I am ready. This is perfect. Dance skill, the peacock strut to Cyrus. The peacock strut. Who has full ability and still has one turn of double strike. What is the My focus is Scholar unparalleled. skill. Unparalleled. Firestorm. A great inferno to scorch the land. A great inferno to scorch the land. Oh, that that was awesome. Here goes I enjoyed that. Alrighty. Apothecary skill. Uh, and poison. Take your poison. Now he's poisoned at the max turn. I am ready. Okay, let's do. Let's see. What can I do next? I think what I need is to set up Cyrus. Uh, yes. So let's do the large pomegranate. Stay strong. That was a really smart move on my part. What is the no, the true lesson Scholar. We're gonna do another firestorm. No. My turn. Okay. Next, let's do merchant. I'm like, yeah, we'll stick. There we go. Where's the nearest tavern? Alfin got all the way up to level 31. I'm really happy about that because we will need all these characters up to a high level, especially if we're about to do what I think we're about to do. Ugh. The bleeding. Not this again. I think I also left him poisoned. <gasps> Are you okay? Oh. Uh. <sighs> Thank the gods. He's still breathing. Sit tight now. That'll do her. That should do for now. But there ain't no time to waste. Need to get him someplace dry and treat the wound properly. A few days later... But that's wonderful. Oh, Timothy, bless me. My dearest Timothy, I promise I'll never let you go. Ever, ever again. Mother? <laughs> yes? What is it, my boy? Huh? Who was that man who saved me?
Head southeast out of town. I'm assuming Ogden is going to stop us. Yeah. So you leave in this place? That's right. Those who are sick are now well. My work here is done. Hmm. Let me ask you something. Sure. Make it quick. You know, I... By saving a robber's life, I put an innocent boy's... I put an innocent boy's in danger. And in the end, I gave in. Did what I had to do. And bloodied my own hands. If I had to do it over, what could I have done different? I was... Was I too naive to do what I did? My mind goes in circles, and I can't find the answer. Hmm. Life is nothing but a series of choices. Our job's the same. We have to decide what's worth keeping and what should be thrown away. You made a poor choice. It's that simple. <sighs> There was a time when I was as indiscriminate as you. It was ten years ago, when I started practicing my craft. I was living with my wife in a tiny village. One day, a wanted criminal came to our home. He had evaded his captors, but at great cost. His wounds were dire. I knew what he was, and still I took him into my home and tended to him. I believed, much like you do, that every life was worth saving. With each passing day, his condition improved. I was filled with pride for my skills, and joy for my patient's recovery. Then one day... I went off into the woods to gather ingredients for a potion. I returned to find my wife on the floor, unrecognizable, in a pool of her own blood. I had no choice but to accept the truth. I saved the wrong life. I left my village behind and wandered from town to town. Ever since then, I treat only those I choose to treat. And save only those lives that deserve to be saved. Those hands of yours can shape the world. Think before you use them. There was another who practiced his craft the way you do. I just don't know. I still don't have the answer. What would you have done? If you're out there, can you send me some kind of message? Anything at all. And so Alfin left Saint's Bridge behind, his heart once brimming with confidence, weighing heavy and hollow in his chest. Was I wrong to believe what I believed? What would you have done? He called out to the man who once saved him, but to no avail. His steps unsure, he set out for Orwell in the cliff lands. And with that, we're going to call it an episode. What we're going to do next is going to be back to back uh, story objectives. So we had finished Alphans and we're going to jump immediately into Therians. Speaking of. He said in Orwell, so if we go to our map, we can see exactly where Orwell lies, which is here. 
So the best route to get there would be to go from South Quarry Crest Pass down. And also, if you notice, the Riverlands cut off right here. So we cannot continue to the third area of Riverlands from the Riverlands. Just wanted to point that out. So next time, we head back to the Wellspring with Therian. And what we're going to do is we're going to pull out another character who we need to uh, work on. We're going to switch Alfin for, let's go with Hanit. And pop open and... Because we need that job, we're going to pull it off of Alpha. And let's switch parties. Alpha. Also, we're going to swap equipment. Uh, Alpha. Actually, let's, um, ooh, I have not used that in a long time. Okay, so Alfin, we're going to swap him to the Argent. Give you that one. Marksman Longbow. Who has Tomahawk? Tressa. I'm going to keep those bows the way they are. Elemental shield. Let's go with the... Starlight helm. Exotic garb. Perfect. Okay. And while we're at it, skills. Not quite there yet. But we should give her a job. Thief, dancer, warrior would probably be best. Because that increases all of her physical abilities. Oh, she benefits the most as the apothecary. Thief increases attack, no health, accuracy, and all that. Scholar, just her magical capabilities. So we're going to go with Warrior. And let's wrap up her equipment. Actually, Jaguar. You're going to go up to Miguel's Spear. You're going to go up to the Imperial Lance. Perfect. Okay. There we go. Now we are all set and ready to start our next uh, chapter in Therian. And we have Hannah so that we can level her up for her chapter. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Mash that like button and subscribe if you have not for more Octopath Traveler content. We'll see you in the next episode and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.